इफ आई वर यू बाय डगलस जेम्स सीन ए स्मॉल कॉटेज इंटीरियर देयर इज एन एंट्रेंस बैक राइट विच मे बी कर्टंड अनदर डोर टू द लेफ्ट मस्ट बी ए प्रैक्टिकल डोर द फर्नीचर इज सिंपल consisting of a small table towards the left a chair or two and a divan rather upstairs on the right on the table is a telephone when the curtain rises gerard is standing by the table making a phone call he is of medium height and wearing horn rimmed glasses He is dressed in a lounge suit and a great coat. His voice is cultured. Gerard, well, tell him to phone up directly. I must know. Yes, I expect I'll still be here, but you mustn't count on that. In about ten minutes' time, right? Ho, goodbye. He puts down the phone and goes to the divan on the left. where there is a traveling bag and starts packing whilst he is thus engaged another man similar in build to gerard enters from the right silently revolver in hand he is flashily dressed in an overcoat and a soft hat he bumps accidentally against the table and at the sound gerard turns quickly Gerard pleasantly why this is a surprise mr uh, intruder i am glad you are pleased to see me i don't think you'll be pleased for long put those paws up gerard this is all very melodramatic not very original perhaps but intruder trying to be calm and a uh, gerard nonchalant is your word i think intruder thanks a lot you'll soon stop being smart i'll make you crawl i want to know a few things see gerard anything you like i know all the answers but before we begin i should like to change my position you may be comfortable but i am not intruder sit down there and no funny business motions to a chair and seats himself on the divan by the bag now then we'll have a nice little talk about yourself gerard at last a sympathetic audience i'll tell you the story of my life how as a child i was stolen by the gypsies and why at the age of 32 i find myself in my lonely essex cottage how intruder keep it to yourself and just answer my questions you live here alone well do you gerard i am sorry i thought you were telling me not asking me a question of inflection your voice is unfamiliar intruder with emphasis do you live here alone gerard and if i don't answer intruder you got enough sense not to want to get hurt gerard i think good sense is shown more in the ability to avoid pain than in the mere desire to do so what do you think mr uh, intruder never mind my name I like yours better Mr Gerard what are your christian names Gerard Vincent Charles Intruder do you run a car Gerard no Intruder that's a lie you are not dealing with a fool I am as smart as you and smarter and I know you run a car better be careful wise guy Gerard Are you American or is that merely a clever imitation? Intruder, listen, this gun's no toy. I can hurt you without killing you and still get my answers. Gerard, of course, if you
put it like that i'll be glad to assist you i do possess a car and it's in the garage round the corner intruder that's better do people often come out here gerard very rarely surprisingly few people take the trouble to visit me there is the baker and the green grocer of course and then there is the milkman quite charming but no one so interesting as yourself intruder i happen to know that you never see trades people gerard you seem to have taken a considerable amount of trouble since you know so much about me won't you say something about yourself you have been so modest intruder i could tell you plenty you think you are smart but i am the top of the class round here i have got brains and i use them that's how i got where i have gerard and where precisely have you got it didn't require a great brain to break into my little cottage intruder when you know why i've broken into your little cottage you'll be surprised and it won't be a pleasant surprise gerard with you figuring so largely in it that is understandable by the way what particular line of crime do you embrace or aren't you a specialist intruder my speciality is jewel robbery your car will do me a treat it's certainly a dandy bus gerard i am afraid jewels are few and far between in the wilds of essex intruder so are the cops i can retire here nicely for a little while gerard you mean to live with me a trifle sudden isn't it you've not been invited intruder you won't be here long so i didn't trouble to ask gerard what do you mean intruder this is your big surprise i am going to kill you gerard a little harsh isn't it intruder with heavy sarcasm yeah i'll be sorry to do it i've taken a fancy to you but it's just got to be done gerard why add murder to your other crimes it's a grave step you are taking intruder i am not taking it for fun i have been hunted long enough i am wanted for murder already and they can't hang me twice gerard you are planning a gratuitous double so to speak admitted you have nothing to lose but what have you to gain intruder i've got freedom to gain as for myself i am a poor hunted rat as vincent charles gerard i am free to go places and do nothing i can eat well and sleep and without having to be ready to beat it at the sight of a cop gerard in most melodramas the villain is foolish enough to delay his killing long enough to be frustrated you are much luckier intruder i am okay i have got a reason for everything i am going to be vincent charles gerard see i have got to know what he talks like now i know that post stuff comes easy this is mr v c gerard speaking pantomime of phoning in imitation cultured voice and that's not all he stands up get up a minute gerard stands now take a look at me gerard you are not particularly decorative intruder no well that goes for you too i only go to wear specs and i'll be enough like you to get away with it gerard what about your clothes they let you down if you are not careful intruder that will be all right yours will fit me fine 
जराड दैट इज एक्सट्रीमली इंटरेस्टिंग बट यू सीम टू मिस द पॉइंट ऑफ माई रिमार्क आई सेड यू वर लकियर दैन मोस्ट मेलड्रोमैटिक विलन्स इट वॉज नॉट ए ट्रिब्यूट टू योर इंटेलिजेंस यू वॉन्ट किल मी फॉर ए वेरी गुड रीजन इंट्रूड सो दैट्स वट यू थिंक जराड यू लेट मी गो एंड थैंक गॉड यू डिडेंट शूट सुनर इंट्रूड कम ऑन वॉट्स ऑन योर माइंड बैटर बी क्विक दिस कॉन्वर्सेशन बोर्ज मी जराड योर आइडिया इज टू इलूड द पुलिस बाय किलिंग मी एंड टेकिंग ऑन माय आइडेंटिटी इंट्रूड यस आई लाइक द आइडिया जराड बट आर यू श्योर इट्स गोइंग टू हेल्प यू इंट्रूड नाउ लिसन हियर आई हैव गोट दिस ऑल प्लैंड आई डिड ए जॉब इन टाउन थिंग्स वेंट रोंग एंड आई किल्ड ए कॉप सिंस देन आई हैव डन नथिंग बट डोज जराड एंड दिस इज वेयर डोजिंग हैज ब्रॉट यू इंट्रूड इट ब्रॉट मी टू एल्सबरी दैट्स वेयर आई सा यू इन द कार टू अदर पीपल सा यू एंड स्टार्टेड टू टॉक आई लिसन इट लुक्स लाइक यू आर ए बिट क्वियर काइंड ऑफ ए मिस्ट्री मैन जराड ए मिस्ट्री विच आई प्रपोज टू एक्सप्लेन इंट्रूड डिस रिगार्डिंग हिम you phone your orders and sometimes you go away suddenly and come back just the same those are just the things i want to do hearing about you was one of my luckiest breaks gerard apparently you haven't the intelligence to ask why i am invested in this cloak of mystery intruder preparing to shoot as i said before this conversation bores me gerard don't be a fool if you shoot you'll hang for sure if not as yourself then as vincent charles gerard intruder what is this gerard this is your big surprise i said you wouldn't kill me and i was right why do you think i am here today and gone tomorrow never see trades people you say my habits would suit you you are a crook do you think i am a sunday school teacher the games up as far as i am concerned things went wrong with me i said it with bullets and got away unfortunately they got one of my men and found things the fool should have burnt tonight i am expecting trouble my bags packed ready to clear off there it is intruder it's a bag all right and this is a gun all right what's all this gerard that's a disguise outfit false mustaches and what not now do you believe me intruder musingly i don't know gerard for god's sake clear that muddled head of yours and let's go come with me in the car i can use you if you find it's a frame you have got me in the car and you still got your gun intruder may be you are right gerard then don't waste time goes and picks up hat and bag intruder careful boss i am watching you gerard i have got a man posted on the main road he'll ring up if he sees the police but i don't want to leave telephone bell rings come on they are after us through here straight to the grass intruder how do i know that you are telling the truth gerard oh don't be a fool look for yourself Gerard opens the door and steps away. Intruder leans forward to inspect it with his side towards Gerard but with the revolver ready. As he turns his head, Gerard gives him a push into the cupboard, knocking the revolver out of his hand. He slams the door and locks it, picks up the revolver and goes to the phone where he stands with the gun. 
pointed at the cupboard door. Intruder rattles door and shouts, "Let me out of here!" Gerard, "Hello, yes, speaking. Sorry, I can't let you have the props in time for rehearsal. I've had a spot of bother. Quite amusing." I think I'll put it in my next play. Listen, can you tell our friend the sergeant to come up here at once? You'll probably find him in the public bar. Thank you.